Is 2017 going to be a great year for the WWE 5155 channel? Oh yeah. Well, this is the first video of 2017 on my channel, and go figure, of course it's gotta be a Hot Wheels Monster Jam video. We are looking at the back of Case C, and uh, it actually looks pretty good. I mean, we got the updated Bad News Travels Fast. It's a mud trucks. Nice to see the mud trucks are back. Well, actually, I wasn't really surprised. We got the Orange Grave Digger. Nice. We got the Tour Favorites Farewell Edition Medusa. We got a Mud Trucks Titan, which I'm actually pretty excited about because that actually looks pretty cool. And uh, for the second year in a row, Zombie Hunter and Titan are both released in the same case. Pirate's Curse is back for anyone who missed out on it in 2016. NEA returned, except we get the blue version and it looks sick. And then there's Team Hot Wheels Firestorm, which I'm pretty sure everybody's got. This is the Farewell Edition Medusa. Um, this one's actually pretty special, and I will eventually unbox it. Uh, it's just uh, I currently can't unbox any more trucks because my display area is actually falling apart. And by that, I mean... Now, I know it's a little bit hard to tell, but this leg right here is bending due to the weight of all the trucks. And, well, as you can see... Oh, ain't that a pretty sight. Look at that. No, it's so dark, but yep. There's this wooden piece I found to help try, and you can see no other nightmares getting killed in there. And, you know, it's, yeah, I, mm-hmm, they're overstuffed. I have way too many trucks, as you can see. And, um, yeah, I just, I need a new area, or I need to move them, because this thing's coming down. And it comes crashing down, and it hurts inside. Actually, you know what? I was just about to go, and I uh, don't know if you can tell, but that's definitely curved. That's scary, because I'm going to come home one day, and then it's going to be broken, and all of them are going to be all over the floor, and, you know, I'm going to cry. But that doesn't stop the fact that I will still eventually unbox this. What the heck? I'm not talking about you. I'm talking about this. So here it is, the Farewell Edition Medusa. Um, why it's the farewell edition is because this is Medusa's last tour. Last, us. Uh, I don't even know what to say. Yeah, brain fart. The last time Medusa will be competing on the Monster Jam Tour for the 2017 season, she is retiring. And, uh, this is basically the regular pink Medusa, just instead of it being pink, it's chrome, and the logo's just stayed the same and of course the top part right here just says Medusa Farewell Tour. Now there is a variant for the 2016 version where it is the pink one and it says Farewell Tour. However, I have not found that and not a lot of people have. On the back you can see it says Monster Jam two-time champion with the new Monster Jam logo. The grill is chrome and shiny. As you can see the light reflection right off of it. There's the flag and on the back I'm assuming it says Medusa, something like that. And um yeah, so that is the Farewell Edition Medusa. Tour favorites, not Chrome. So now that Medusa is out of the way, let's talk about that truck you just saw. The Bad News Travels Fast. This is the, whoa, this is the first mud trucks out of seven that we're going to be getting this year. And uh, I'm actually really happy because there was a leaked poster that someone found on the computer, or I should I say the internet, I mean, if you're on the computer, you can see it much clearer. I recommend that. Um, but someone found a leaked poster of uh, the series of 2017 trucks that are coming out. We're getting mud trucks. We're getting superheroes. Edge Glow is coming back. There are three blackouts, and one of them, I'm already going to say it. Spoiler alert, Max D is coming back. Flashbacks, uh, it's Team Mints, the Michigan Ice Monster, uh, and the Hot Wheels that obviously came out in case A. Um, not The other ones haven't been revealed yet. And uh, we're getting a yellow zombie. I can't wait to get that. And, uh, of course, Gas Monkey Garage and Alien Invasion are also going to be coming out. Color Treads, of course, are returning. I mean, some people thought that was a one-year thing. We're only getting four this year. Uh, we're going to get a Doomsday. Hopefully it's a new tool, and it looks like it from the picture. Uh, Color Treads, uh, Ice Cream Man, which is pretty cool, I guess. I was expecting Ice Cream Man to be X-Ray. And a Color Treads Higher Education, and the fourth one has yet to be revealed and uh, hopefully Case D comes out uh, within a few weeks because I'm really excited and hopefully we get our next flashback truck in that case. 
So, I don't know, we'll see. Um, but, yeah, this is the first of seven mud trucks, and I'm going to be talking to you guys about what I think the rest of the mud trucks should be for the year. So, uh, real quickly, I'm going to show you the uh, Bad News Travels Fast. It says Sign Pro on the back, and it says you lose to Bad News with very, very mild mud graphics. Can you see that? You can sort of see it. In the names, it's brown. That's the mud, the quote-unquote mud. Uh, the tires actually have some pretty good amount of mud on them, unlike um, some of the trucks last year. Uh, nice chrome. There's the body up on the top. You got the house, and there's the uh, hood. Actually, you know, not a lot of mud there. It actually looks like a pretty decent truck. So, um, that's the Bad News Travels Fast mud truck, the first one for uh, the mud trucks of this year. Now, um... I would, however, like to point out that we have also got another mud trucks, and this is number two. It's Titan. Now, like I said, I don't have Titan, and it's on the back of the case, like I said. Uh, I actually, I can't wait to get that Titan. I feel it's really nice with the mud trucks. So this is number two, mud trucks Titan, and we also, from that leaked poster I was talking about, we got to uh, see our third mud trucks that's going to be coming out later this year, the Return of Thunder 4x4. So this is going to be mud trucks number three, and... Um, I don't know, I actually might get all the mud trucks this year just because I, I feel like I'm in a good mood. I, I asked the Magic 8 Ball and it says it's going to be a good year for me. So, Thunder 4x4 is number 3. Now I have a few others that I'm going to predict and hopefully we do see them come uh, back for the season. Uh, for I should say for the year for Hot Wheels Monster Jam. And uh, I'd like to see these ones become mud trucks as well. This one, I don't know, a lot of people would probably predict it. Barbarian. We haven't seen Barbarian since the Battle Slammers, and I think Barbarian's return in 2017 would be nice as a Mud Trucks. I mean, I'd be looking forward to it. I think it'd be pretty cool. I mean, they did a Mud Trucks with the old uh, paint scheme of Barbarian, so why not do it with the new one? So, Barbarian's one I'd like to see. Another one I'd like to see, um, they did... How many special things did they do this? I think they only did one. They did an X-ray version of Aftershock, but they haven't done anything else to it. And I, Actually, you know what? No, they did do a Mud Trucks Aftershock already. I think in 2013, it was the old tool, uh, old paint scheme Aftershock, but I'd like to see the new tool one have some mud on it. I don't know, just because it's updated and, you know, collectors obviously will want it, so why not? Next up, I'd like to see at least one of the El Toro Locos get a cool design this year. And, um, not talking about Blackout, so how about the regular Black El Toro Loco gets a mud trucks design? I mean, why not, right? Actually throw some mud on it, make it look cool. Um, they actually should really do something really cool with it. And finally, number seven of the mud trucks. I uh, I don't know. A lot of people probably won't agree with this one. Um, however, I really don't know. It can go either way. Carolina Crusher mud trucks. I just feel like uh, you can throw some mud on there, make it stand out a little bit more. I mean, after all, it's just two colors of a truck, just red and yellow, and it just says that. I mean, you can throw some mud up there, throw some mud back here, make it look sweet. I mean, put some mud decals back there. Be awesome. So uh, I think those would be a great. Uh, fit for the seven mud trucks. I don't know. You guys tell me who you think you would uh, switch out and who would you keep for mud trucks. I don't know. I just feel like that'd be a cool idea to throw Carolina Crusher, the Black El Toro Loco, the updated Aftershock Barbarian, and Thunder 4x4 uh, Titan, and Bad News obviously are confirmed, and Bad News is already here. So I'm gonna end the video now, and uh, you guys can have a nice little friendly conversation in the comments section. Hopefully the next video I do will be the unboxings, that's right, unboxings, of the entire silver collection. And for those of you who don't know what it is, just look it up. Trust me. It's 25 years of Monster Jam.